How to build a website on Pixies. Hello, hope you're doing good. I'm your host, Jason. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to create a website using Pixies. Pixies is a platform that is built for photographers that would like to create a portfolio which will allow them to share, sell, and also add an online presence. So you can go on to Pixies.com and tap on Get Started and you'll be able to sign up for free using your email address. After doing that, you're going to tap right where you see Edit Website and you're going to be redirected to a new page. On this new page, you can scroll down and you can select whichever one of these templates you'd like to use. So let's say for example, I would like to use this theme. I'm going to tap on Apply Theme. After you have done that, you can see it is being applied right there then you'll be redirected to the editor page. Once on the editor page, all you'll need to do is pay attention to the left-hand column. And this will list out all of the different areas on your website. So you have the home page, which we are currently viewing. If you would like to edit the home page, you can do that by tapping on the picture. Then you'll go over to the left-hand column once more, and you can change the pictures that are currently in the slide. If you would like to remove them, you can tap on the trash can to remove it and you can tap on the pick. Then from there, you could choose to upload a picture. You can also change the title right here. If you want, you could add in a different title and subtitle. You could also change the button text from the left hand column and you can add in the page that you would like to redirect persons to once they click on the button. So for example, I could tap on select page and I'm going to redirect persons once they click on this button to my portfolio. After you have done that, you can go back. So let's go back real quick. You can also toggle on auto slide if you want. Then you will go back. After doing that, we can tap on about and you can edit the about section. Again, you can tap on the picture right there and you could change the pic. So let's say for example, I were to upload a picture so I'm going to select my computer and I'm just going to be selecting a random image. So let's say, for example, this thumbnail, I'm just going to be using the thumbnail for example sake. After doing that, you can also change the title. So you could tap here, you could change the title. You could scroll down, change the subtitle. Then you can change the body right there if you want. And again, you can redirect persons to a particular page on your website by tapping on select page. Then let's say I want to redirect them to the portfolio page once more. I can add it right there. After doing that, you can go back and you could select testimonials and you can edit each section by scrolling down. Then once in the portfolio section, you can tap on couples. And from there, you could edit the pictures that are currently there, or you could tap on the three dots in line with portfolio. And from there, if you would like to delete it, you can do that. If you would like to get a QR code so that you can share your portfolio, you can also do that. As you can see, there are numerous options that you can choose from. And if it is a case that you would like to add more pages, you can tap on add page at the top. Then after doing that, you can select add a new page or you can choose to add a link in your menu if you want or add a blog to your website. There are numerous options that you can choose from. So if we were to tap on add page, after doing that, you can see the different pages that you can quickly add. So if you'd like to add a portfolio page, you can do that. You can also tap on gallery and you could add a gallery page if you want. Once you're finished and everything is to your liking, you can tap on preview in the bottom left hand corner and you'll be able to preview how your website looks. So you can see it right there. Once it is to your liking, you'll tap on publish in the top right hand corner and your website will now be live. And by the way, you can scroll down and we could tap on the different sections right there and you can edit it. You could change the title if you want and you can also change the picture as what I've shown you earlier by selecting the picture. And that's it basically. Once you're finished, you'll tap on publish and your website will be live and you'll be able to share it so you can see it right there. And if I were to tap on publish once more, that's it. Thanks for watching. Hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit the like button.